fin watch this video through to the finish. If you have rare us and international coins you'd like to sell, and I'll show you where to list them for sale. Most likely in nearly uncirculated condition. This coin is a 1997 E10 cent, a recently circulated coin with distinct mint luster traces. And the mint mark identifies it as having been made by a Demer branch of some mint. Those components are primarily hit fields with a lot of tight polish lines surrounding. Portrait of Roosevelt, a significant die chip on the nose, is the main source of distraction. Sharply detailed gadget parts are seen on the reverse track. It clearly resembles a full bands variation. I looked at it closely and the upper and lower bands were detached. I'll do what I can. In Philadelphia, 1997, with P mint mark. More than 480 million Roosevelt times were struck. They are everywhere 1997 with P mint mark coins start to be worth more than their face value at circulating grades. They are worth $122 a zero at uncirculated grades in primary state 66 with full bands on. The torch it denotes that they are 16,790 and the primary state is 168,800. But the 1997 issue that has garnered the most interest is accepted mid mark S was missing in the San Francisco issue. This per 69 graded concern coin is one. The 1997 numbers proof time is ranked third among Scott Shear and Jeff Garrett's list of the 100 greatest U S modern coins. While authors claim that any manufacturing flaw in a proof coin is not worth it due to its significant, how much special care was put into their manufacturer coinage errors. Proofs are actually extremely uncommon. It's interesting to note that the San Francisco mint originally produced these proofs in 1997. A uh, tiny number, probably 10,000 pieces were produced using Dion, which the SM minute mark had not been correctly pierced. The current illustration shows a ring of olive and orange, orange hue, although it is high reverse. The surfaces are dazzling. It was auctioned at air TG auctions for $100,500. I appreciate you guys watching before you move on to another video. Kindly check that you have subscribed on the live buttons. Uh, next up the 1979. Lincoln one cent with the D minute mark was minted at the Denver mint. It's part of the broader Lincoln Memorial cent series, which ran from 1959 to 2008. The D minute mark signifies that this coin was produced in Denver, adding an extra layer of intrigue for collect. 1979 with D mint mark Lincoln one cent coin special struck at the Denver mint. This coin is part of the iconic Lincoln cent series honoring the 16th president of the United States. Abraham Lincoln. Inspect your coin closely. Look for well-defined features, including Lincoln's profile on the obverse and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. Condition matters, so check for wear, scratches, or any other imperfections. Condition is key when determining the value of coins, and the 1979 Lincoln one cent is no exception. Um, a coin in good condition generally means minimal wear and tear with visible details and a well-preserved appearance. Factors like scratches, discoloration, or dents can impact its overall value. The uh, value of the 1979 Lincoln one cent with the D mint mark in good condition. As of my last knowledge update in early 2022, the market value could vary, but it was typically in the range of $200,500. However, keep in mind that coin values can fluctuate based on market demand, rarity, and other factors. Next up, the UK. Two new pence, 1971 coin in uncirculated condition. Now, if you've ever wondered about the worth of this classic coin, you're in the right place. Our spotlight today is on the UK two new pence coin from 1971. Released during a pivotal time in British history, this coin holds both historical and collectible significance. Before we jump into the value, let's briefly discuss the historical context of the coin. 1971 marked the year of decimalization in the UK. And this coin was one of the first to embrace the new currency system. Uh, now, when we talk about value, the condition of the coin matters. Uncirculated coins kept in pristine condition are highly sought after by collectors. The two new pence coin in uncirculated condition boasts its original mint luster. Let's talk about the current market value of the UK two new pence 1971 coin in uncirculated condition. As of 2022, the value fluctuates but it generally falls in the range of $300,500, this value based on condition. Ensure your coin is indeed in uncirculated condition by checking for any signs of wear or damage. Uh, additionally, keeping it in a protective case can help maintain its value. Don't forget to like subscribe and stay tuned for more coin-related content. Happy collecting.